woman beat up by a man and she says he used racial slurs while throwing those punches. This was all caught on camera at a BP gas station in Arlington. This video has been shared hundreds of times on social media. All your sides, Destiny McKeever spoke with the woman in that viral video and a warning tonight. This video is a little hard to watch. New pictures of 23 year old Ramey McCoy's face show bruising after a vicious attack at a gas station in Arlington. McCoy says she was here at the BP on Fort Carolina University to get gas Monday, but left after a man hit her several times. She says it's all because she asked for space at the register. Today, McCoy still has bruising, so she didn't show her face for the interview. I went to BP to get gas. And as I was walking in, it was a guy out there arguing with the guy in the video. He was arguing with the Indian guy. And when I went, I walked around him to go inside. When I went in, he came in after me. And he basically was just like, he was like yelling about y'all kind. Y'all need to go back, go back to where you came from. McCoy says the man in the video was already agitated and using racist language toward another customer. McCoy says when he sat his beer too close to her at the register, Things went left. In the video, when you see me move my arm, I'm pushing his beers away from me, like telling him, like, get away from me, like, sir, move, get away. And once I pushed the beers away from, from me, he started punching me in my head. McCoy went to the hospital for her injuries, but doctors say she should be okay. In the meantime, police need help finding this man. They say he was driving an orange Chevy Sonic at the time of the attack. If you see him, call police. Hoping that they find him, like, I just really want them to find him at this point. Destiny McKeever, First Coast News, on your side. Mm. And we did reach out to uh, witnesses listed in the police report, but so far we haven't heard back. Now, in response to this story, the Jacksonville branch of the NAACP released this statement tonight. It says, quote, the actions of the suspect in this video is completely unacceptable and appears to be racially motivated. There's absolutely no excuse for his behaviors, end quote. It went on to say the group is demanding the sheriff's office do the right thing by arresting the man in that video as quickly as possible.